Hey, it's Diane. I'm back with the last video in the series on how to make a perfect cup of coffee with the final touch being using the spifter. Okay, here's two beautiful cups of coffee. My friend Giles is on his way over to share this with me because he couldn't wait to taste my idea of a perfect cup of coffee. So I'm getting it ready. I am going to use a little bit of cocoa in mine. And I'm going to talk about the spifter, actually. Let me talk about it. So the spifter is designed with, uh, it's a sifting spoon. See, see how cute it is? It's a tiny little bowl. It's about a tablespoon worth. But it comes with three interchangeable sifting bowls, fine, medium, large. So depending on the herb or the spice or the sugar that you're using would de determine which, which um, mesh screen you would use. So the cocoa's a little bit thicker. So I'm going to go with the, thick, the uh, wider screen for this one and just do a little dabble on uh, my cup here. And you just put a little teeny bit into the spoon. Look at how little I have in there. And then you just tap the spice exactly where you want. Look how good that looks. You know what, I'm making his the same way. Same way, look at that. Now, the beauty of this is with a shaker, it's gonna go all over the place and make a mess. It's gonna be wasteful and you're gonna have a mess to clean up. This goes exactly where you want, exactly how much you want on there. So I like to do a little bit of cocoa, but I also have vanilla here, and I have cinnamon here in containers, and then I have nutmeg, a little package. What's great about the spifter, if I wanted to put nutmeg on it, which I will, um, I'm going to go back and I'm going to use the fine bowl, because you don't want too strong a flavor. That's a strong spice. So just do a little hint of it, and look at it. It fits right in the bag. How would you do this otherwise? You'd have to use your fingers to sprinkle, which would... Um, make a mess on your hands and uh, put germs on your coffee, which you don't want to do. But look at that, a little teeny bit on there. And look, it just adds the tiniest little amount of flavor. It's a strong spice, so you don't want to add a lot. And, um, and then you get to put the spice you don't use back in the container, so there's no waste. There's no mess, no waste. So um, sometimes I like to put a little stevia in also, but today I think this, this looks great. So anyway, he, He's going to be here any minute, so here, let me put this down, and let me just say to you, I have loved doing this video series with you. Um, if you don't have a spifter, you need a spifter. If you're a coffee aficionado and you really care about your coffee experience, the spifter is the only product in the world, in the world, that does this. It's the only one this size, this function. Um, it's got so many other uses. Uh, it's great for decorating appetizers and entrees. It's, but it's amazing for, for making the perfect cup of coffee. If that was the only reason why you used it, then it should be a part of your toolkit in your kitchen for making coffee. So you should have the spifter. See, I have the spifter. I have my very special coffee scoop. I mean, this is special to me. So this is part of my tools. And then I have my handheld frother, as you know. So, you know, just like uh, you know, a, a mechanic uh, or a handyman needs all his tools on his tool belt, you need all the tools in your kitchen, too. And this will make each cup of coffee you make very special. It'll upscale and upgrade your coffee drinking experience. I hope you've enjoyed this. If you want to find out more about the Spifter, it's available at Amazon. So go to Amazon.com and type in Spifter. I mean, it's easy to uh, th just remember, sp think spoon, sifter, Spifter. It's portmanteau. I'm, I'm into portmanteaus. I like combining words together. It's a lot of fun. So anyway, um, I hope you've enjoyed this series. I can't wait to hear back about your favorite perfect cup of coffee and what that looks like and how you do it. And um, cheers. Here's to... Here's to many more cups of coffee together. Thanks so much. Bye.